Over the next several videos, I'm going to show you how you can create on-screen touch controls that you can use when making iPad games. Throughout these step-by-step -step tutorials, we'll use a classic D-pad and two-button setup to drive our actor around the screen. And once you've learned these simple but powerful rules, you'll be able to apply them to an endless amount of control schemes. Now because the focus of this tutorial is to teach you how to create on-screen controls for your iPad games, I won't be reviewing the steps that I took to create the 3D models of the controls themselves. But don't forget if you want to learn all about 3D and model your own controls from scratch, just check out the hours of in-depth computer animation tutorials here at the App Trainer website. Now before we start setting up the controls in Game Salad, let's take a look at a brief time lapse which shows the modeling process. That way maybe you'll be inspired to create some of your own original controls.